I'm Roland Matern. I'm the Director of Sales for Eastside by Gentex Corporation. I'm Gary Foster, and I'm an Outreach Advocate for uh, Eastside Gentex Corporation. So we're here in Seattle at Arvo 2024, showcasing our latest product, the Eastside Go. This is our latest generation Eastside product. Technologically, we have improved the autofocus. We have given it fantastic image stabilization. We have brighter, higher resolution monitors. And the form factor has changed from quite a large, heavy device to a glasses-like uh, form factor, a third of the weight. We've taken the battery out of the device uh, and put it on your, around your neck, so it's very comfortable. The battery life has also increased um, by almost 50%. And our field of view is now 45 degrees. So um, we've had fantastic feedback from over 100 users and testing so far. So we look forward to bringing this device uh, to the AMD community. Eastside by Gentex Corporation Technology has been clinically validated to give seven lines of distance acuity, 12 letters of contrast, and up to six lines of near acuity back to the wearer. We focus on individuals with 20 over 80 to 20 over 600 uh, visual acuity. And in many cases, our users go back to functional vision for activi activities of daily living uh, and increased quality of life. And they enjoy their hobbies and passions, whatever it may be. Gary Foster is one of our wearers since 2015. So he's had years of experience with the various models of, of eSight. So Gary, why don't you give us a little bit of insight into the impact has had on your daily life? Well certainly when you start to lose your vision and everything starts to change, your whole world starts to change and it starts to shrink. And uh, and I was a very active person and was I found myself now with too much time on my hands, I lost my job and, and it, was, it, it was very depressing quite frankly. Um, I learned about eSight quite by accident and when I tried it for the first time I instantly saw oh my goodness, there are huge possibilities here. And the very first thing I saw was my wife's face. And I couldn't believe it. I, I mean, I, I, I said to her, I, I can see everybody's face. And that was so foreign to me. I'm 2400 with, without eSight. With eSight, I can read to the bottom of the eye chart. It's absolutely phenomenal what it does. So in my case, it put me back to most of my daily activities except driving a car. It put me back to work full time, which I was really excited about. And I am retired now, but I am, we, my wife and I are both so uh, thankful for what this has done for us, for our family, that I spend my days now explaining to people, um, this is available, this is what it can do for you, and I want everybody that went through what I was going through to be able to have this opportunity. It's life changing, I guess that's the best thing I can say. It's absolutely life-changing. And I do, honestly, do everything I ever did before. I have a woodworking shop. I design and build furniture. I'm back to doing all of the things that I ever did except drive a car. It's phenomenal. Are these made to wear over your glasses, or does this device allow for a corrective prescription? Yeah, it is not designed to go over your existing glasses, but inside the device, we have the ability to get your prescription and we have custom lenses created for those individuals that still benefit from refractive correction and the um, device will have your correction built right into it. Is this simply a magnification device or what other features does it offer and how does it work? So it's all adjustable. Uh, we have a camera on the front of the device that captures a central image. It is run through a, a software algorithm that allows you to manipulate the digital image with contrast, brightness, color filters, magnification, all the things that tabletop CCTVs are capable of doing. And then it is projected in, onto two OLED monitors, uh, one in front of each eye. And then the uh, wearer uses their remaining usable retina uh, to see the image and have the photoreceptors process the image um, in the brain. So Gary, can you share what you see while you're wearing this device? I've seen you walking around while wearing the unit, and that's pretty amazing. One thing that eSight has always been able to do in all of its various versions is allow me access to my peripheral vision. So when I'm wearing my eSight, I still have my spatial orientation. I know where I am. I don't get dizzy when I'm walking. Uh, you know, I'm, if I'm walking down the street and I, I use, mostly I use my peripheral vision, 
unless I'm approaching something and I need more detail, then I'll look at it through the eyewear, where I'll get that complete detail. I, I, if I'm looking for an address, for example, I'm walking down the street, it's the east side that tells me that's number 302 or 541. Without it, I wouldn't have a hope. I wouldn't be, I'd be asking people, Is it, where am I? <laughs> so yeah, I think one of the most exciting things about eSight is that it does give me complete mobility. So I go shopping on my own. I don't need any assistance. I don't have to have someone point out the, the soup aisle or what, the, what brand or what are the ingredients on the can. I do all that on my own. I travel all over North America, quite frankly, through air, airports and everything else unassisted, and I, I certainly couldn't do that if I didn't have eSight. So that mobility factor, to me, is one of the most important factors of the product. Yeah, the mobility certainly drives the independence uh, with, this, with this device. Mm -hmm. I see that you have a remote in your hand. Can you tell me how that's used? There are a number of ways to control the device. You have the remote control. Um, with the key functions, uh, functionality, uh, toggle up, down, and your menu button, and volume for the audio feedback. But those controls are also on the right temple arm. So you can control the device completely hands-free just by uh, reaching up to the temple, or if those prefer to use the remote control, that is an option as well. Uh, functionally, they, they act exactly the same way. I'm old school. <laughs> I like the remote because I've been doing it that way forever. But honestly, I mean, the younger people just do this. Yeah. yeah. And they're all very, very tactile, so it's very easy to distinguish uh, the buttons. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so it makes it very easy to use. Okay, so let's say you're at the grocery, you're walking around using your profile vision to maneuver the aisles. When you pick up a can, do you need to use the remote or buttons to magnify the label, or how does that work? As a CCTV does, where you can expand the size of the image to read the smaller print, Right, So I don't need to use the, the uh, magnification feature to identify the type of, like the label, because I can see the, the name Campbell Soup stands out very clearly. But certainly to read ingredients, I would just pick that up and then, depending on the size of the print, would determine how much magnification I would use. So really, the only two things I'm doing is increasing or decreasing magnification. That's mostly what I do with the device. And I can be doing that here. But it's, it's, it's almost seamless because after a while, when this is the way you navigate your world, you're just used to the fact that, yep, there's the product. I need more information. I just zoom up on it. It's really, I mean, it just is the way I view my world. It's so easy. Where can this device be purchased? So we do sell direct to consumer via our website. You can fill out uh, a little quiz to see if you're a candidate. And if you are, you can submit your contact information and we'll reach out to you uh, to confirm your candidacy. And we can set up a, um, a remote home trial of the product. But we also work with, with resellers in uh, various parts of the United States. We've also partnered with a number of low vision um, clinics and uh, low vision rehab centers. Uh, and we do have some ophthalmology clinics as well that partner with us and refer patients or fit the device in their office. What are the qualifications that make a good candidate for this device? We focus on individuals with 20 over 80 uh, visual acuity uh, in the better eye, all the way down to 20 over 600. Uh, central vision loss, but you have access to your peripheral um, vision still, so it's great for things like AMD, uh, not so good for things like uh, uh, RP, retinitis pigmentosa, uh, or glaucoma. Um, and those are kind of the main factors. If magnification helps you, that's going to put you in a position that you're probably a, a, a good candidate. Um, things where you're not a good candidate, if you, if you are really a technophobe, you just have some comfort level with technology uh, because it is a digital device. Um, if you have significant tremors or, or um, neuropathy in your fingers, then you have maybe trouble working the remote control. Those kind of things might make it difficult to use. Uh, but for the most part, it's, um, uh, it's a pretty broad um, availability to individuals with AMD or central vision loss due to other uh, reasons. Uh, works great for Stardust disease, that big neuropathy as well. What's the price tag on the eSight Go? So the retail price on the eSight Go is $4,950 uh, US. So is this device by chance covered under any insurance, Medicare, VA, or state Medicaid program? Internet Affairs does cover the eSight 100%. Currently, that's the only insurance in the U.S. that's uh, covering the device. But for all the veterans, uh, they do have access to uh, eSight uh, with it being covered for them. So we do have a few um, projects that are a bit longer term towards reimbursement, but we're not there yet. 
Does Gentex offer any financial assistance, financing, or payment plans for clients who may need help getting this device? We do have payment plans uh, driven through Shopify. What kind of training and support is offered for the eSight Go? So, uh, once you've become an eSight user and you've purchased a device, you have uh, support virtually. We have coaches uh, that are eSight coaches. They're also users like Gary. Um, and you get assigned a coach, and the coach uh, teaches you how to use the device in various um, applications. Being users themselves, not only are they experts on the device, but they're also experts on how to optimize the device for, for different uh, case, use case scenarios. Uh, so a certain number of hours come with the transaction of the device, uh, but they are your contact for life. So if you ever have any issues, you need a new battery, or there's a warranty challenge, uh, whether it's just you're having trouble uh, using the device, they're your first point of contact. You call your coach anytime. Is there anything you'd like to leave us with? I just would like to reiterate that it honestly did give me my life back. And when you've done without, it's you really do believe that you're never going to get there again. And then when you find something like this, and it's, it's real, it absolutely works, as I said. Um, I wasn't prepared for what it was going to give me. And it's not just me. Uh, my wife is no longer my caregiver. I'm re-engaged with my kids and my grandkids. My whole family thinks this thing is fantastic. So yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a life changer. Thank you both for your time and sharing this product and your story with our Macula Degeneration community.